Yo, 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 what is poppin' YouTube? It's your boy AJ with his first Call of Duty video, okay? Hopefully in the near, near, not near future, but, you know, five, ten years from now, I'll be doing these videos before, you know, I'll get the game early. I'll be doing these videos before the game even comes out, so y'all know exactly all the camos, all the guns, and everything like that. I'm sure there's a lot of videos already made on this, but we're going to go ahead and jump right into it, as you can tell by the title, okay? So, um, I'm going to go ahead and be showing you all the weapons, okay, and all the actual weapon camos that you can have on the gun, okay? So, these, we're going to start out with the assault rifles. Um, I'll tell you from my experience, if obviously, if they're level 1, I haven't tried them, um, but uh, we're, we're just going to go ahead and get into it. So, the Kilo 141, my favorite gun in the game, okay? It's level 69, very, very good gun to start out with. Um, I do recommend using the Kilo, obviously, until you unlock the M4A1, okay? The FAL is actually not a very bad gun either. Um, we have actually eight assault rifles off of the release of the game, so the FAL is not that bad. I have not used it yet, but I've seen people use it, and it's not that bad. It's actually an automatic instead of like other Call of Duties where it's semi-automatic. M4A1, best gun in the game. I'm actually not using this gun a lot. I've as, I, I've used it a lot, but I'm not using it as much as the Kilo. I'm trying to get you know other guns in the game gold before I actually do the easier ones. So I'm gonna go go for the harder guns first get the hard work out of the way and then do the easy work in the end and just kind of enjoy it we have the uh which this is kind of like the Famas, the fr 5.56 this is actually a really good gun too if you hit them up, up up above the chest it's probably a one shot one kill every single time it's the three round burst um i'm not too sure if you can make it automatic i know you can make it semi-automatic but um pretty good gun there uh the odin um not a very good gun um, it has a lot of recoil. I'm sure if you get the right attachments on it, it will straight demolish. It kills very, very quickly, but it is not the best in the game. I can definitely tell you that, just from my experience with using it a few times. Uh, the M13, a very good gun in the game. I used this gun the whole beta, and it was very, very nice. Very, very clean. It reminds me a lot of the Kilo, but kind of like an upgraded, more upgraded version. I think this is the next gun I'm going to go for, gold. We have the, the SCAR, okay, y'all, everybody knows this car. It's actually not that great, I'm not going to lie to you. The FN SCAR 17 is not all that great. It has a lot of recoil, but I'm like I said, I'm sure if you put the right upgrades and attachments on it, it'll, it'll demolish, it'll be great. Uh, we have the AK-47. This was actually at the top of the assault rifle list last time. I think they did a big update on the AK because a lot of people were complaining, but um, the AK in real life is probably not better than half these guns but they put it at the bottom so let let activision do what they want to do i'm sure the ak is great i haven't used it yet but uh i'll uh i'll get more in depth into the guns maybe later on in the season whenever we're further along and i've used more guns we have the smgs we have the aug it totally obliterates the aug is very very good probably i see everyone using the aug the p90 or the um mp mp5 uh, the P90 is also very, very good if you get the right attachments on it. Pretty, This game is pretty much about attachments. So if you have the right attachments on a gun, you're pretty much going to be destroying everyone. Whatever gun that you like and you pick, you put the right attachments on it, you level it up, you're going to be demolishing, okay? The MP5 is also a very good gun. You can run very, very quickly with all the SMGs, obviously, because they're SMGs. Finally, it's not like Call of Duty Black Ops 4 or 3 when you have an SMG and you don't run faster than you do with an assault rifle. Just made no sense at all. Um, Uzi, um, also a very good gun. Um, I used it for about a game or two, and it is very, very good. Um, it, you would think it has a lot of recoil, but it doesn't, actually. I think that's why they put it down further in the list. The PP-13, 19, sorry, actually... I have not been able to use yet, but I'm I'm looking forward to it. I don't like how small the sight is, but I know that this gun is going to wreck. It reminds me a lot of MW3. MW3, um, I'm not too sure what it was called. Um, the P, uh, I, I don't know. I, I think it might. It's not. I don't think it was named the same thing. But mistake, mistake me if I'm wrong. I'm not too sure. The MP7 obviously obliterates. The MP7 is very very good. I use this in the beta a lot. Uh, the shotguns, the model. 680 that is a very good shotgun this is a good shot there the shotguns in this game are crazy y'all okay the um r90 shotgun is also very good not better than the 725 the 725 is an insane shotgun um probably the best shotgun that you can use in the game as of now you'll see a lot of people um playing cyber attack um actually using this weapon 
Uh, the Origin Shotgun is also very, very good. As you can tell, you unlock it later on in the game, so it's 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 a very good shotgun. All the shotguns are good. I'm, I'm not going to cap on any of them. They are all very, very good, and I would use every single one of them. Um, the LMGs, I have actually not used any of these, as you can see, but I'm really looking forward to using this one. This looks insane to me. Uh, this, this gun right here is just, wow. Like, it... It doesn't even look like a gun. <laughs> looks like RPG mixed with the LMG. I don't know. Uh, looks like it's got a hundred round drum on there. It looks very, very nice. But uh, we'll get into the LMGs later. I'm pretty sure that this is probably one of the best LMGs. This was in the beta, and I used the M91 a lot in the beta just to see how it was and things like that. They are all very, very good. Uh, now we're getting into the marksman rifles. I have not used the marksman rifles at all, but I know the Car 98K is a one shot, one kill every single time, even if you shoot them in the foot. So I would be using these. A lot of people are going to be sleeping on these guns. They are not sleepers. They are just like sniper rifles, even easier to use, and it's one shot, one kill. I know this one's one shot, one kill. I'm not too sure about these or how quick they shoot or anything. Like I said, I'm going to be making a more in depth videos probably later on in the season. Uh, it's literally day, day two or three. Uh, the sniper rifles, the dragon off's good, the HDR. I'm seeing a lot of people use the HDR to quick scope actually, so I, I need to get into that. The uh, the AX50, we already know how that is. I have some gameplay of it on the beta footage that I posted in my beta review. Y'all can go check that out if you want. AX50, it looks just like the MSR. It works like the MSR. It is very very nice. I love it. And then the melee, we have a riot shield, which I hate because I play cyber attack. It's the only game mode I play, and everyone wants to rock a riot shield and just walk up to you and hit you with the right shield. Well, I'll probably make a video on that too, on how to take people out easy with right shields. But now let's go ahead and get into the can- oh, actually, sorry. Um, let's let's get into the uh, secondaries here. Almost forgot. So the A16 um, is a very good pistol. They buffed it. It was in the, um, it was in the update. Um, I'm pretty sure this past past day they buffed it. It works a lot better now. Uh, the 1911 is all right. It's it's not the best. Obviously, the 357 is is demolishing. It's one shot, one kill above the above the chest, or uh, above the um, above the waist. Sorry, the M19 is also a very good pistol, and the yeah the the Desert Eagle the the Deagle is gonna merc anyone in its sight. We got the launchers. We got the PILA. I'm not too sure how you say it. The the Pilla, maybe the Strela P is also a really good sniper that's going to be to shoot helicopters down things like that if you're really into that getting those rewards that's another one like that i'm pretty sure both of these lock on must make me if i'm wrong but i'm pretty sure i've seen people lock on with both oh my bad also we have the also um the rpg 7 which is like the regular rpg from black ops all the black ops have this rpg it's kind of busted i'm not gonna lie everybody just runs around with an rpg and then the melee, we have the combat knife. So the, honestly, there's not too many guns. I, I, I thought there was going to be a lot more guns, and I'm kind of happy that there isn't because I'm trying to get that Damascus camo. But let's go ahead and get into the camos now. Um, I didn't go to local play for this. This is actually on my account. This is why it took me a day or two to make a video because um, I actually unlocked all the camos so I could show all of you. Obviously, I don't have gold yet. I'm not a, um, I am not have a little bit of a life. I'm not saying that you don't. If you do, calm down. But... Um, well, let's go ahead and get into them. So we have the the first camos. These are just the spray paints. We got the desert snake, the commando, the uh, rip and tear. I'm pretty sure that is. Uh, the Moroccan snake is pretty dope. Uh, the pitter patters, all right. The China lake, um, pinstripe suit, chain link. A, a lot a lot of the the spray paints are. So I only have one more left to get because you have to get 800 kills with every single weapon if you want them gold. Which actually it is not that bad if, if you're a grinder. But uh, I almost have that one unlocked. So those are the spray paints. We have the woodland camos, okay? So these are all of the woodland camos. Swamp, modern woodland, desert hybrid, sand dance. I like that one a lot. Uh, I like the bright camos. People can see them from far away. The marshlands, sick. Uh, kill brush. The warcom greens. Warcom blues. I like the warcom blues a lot. I think that's the next one I unlock. Uh, with headshots so now to unlock your gun on gold you don't have to get 100 headshots or whatever the hell it is on the old call of duties i also like this one a lot too uh, i'm not even going to try and pronounce that because i don't want to butcher the name uh, i think it's canopy i'm not i don't maybe i don't know if that's how you spell canopy but y'all correct me if i'm wrong digital we got the urban digital the jungle digital 
the Arctic Digital, Forest Digital, I think they all in digital, the Marsh, the, the Bark, the Blue, the Classic, and the Desert, oh, and also the Green. I like the green a lot, so I'm, I'm working on gold here. I haven't really been working on it. I'm, I've been working on ranking up, but now that I'm past 55, um, I'm really going to be working on the camos for these guns. So I honestly, when you unlock the dragon, I was very excited because you can actually see it from very far away. People were like, whoa, how'd you get that camo? What did you do? Now we got the dirt. The dirt looks good, too. It, it looks like you won't be able to see it, but it, it looks really sick. That's like a camo you'd have on a gun in real life type shit. Um... The Mosh is sick. I like those. Like I said, I like the bright camos. Tagged is definitely dope. Black Top, it, it's not all that. Some of these camos should, could be a little bit better. Asphalt, but I totally understand. Some people don't like the bright colors. Crime Scene, sick. Uh, the Neon Pink, I love that. I, I love it. Even though I'm not a big pink guy, I, I like it on the gun. Uh, Trailblazer's dope. I'm not even going to pronounce that, but that's the last one for the Dragon. And those are actually not that hard to actually unlock, okay? So then we have the splinters. The splinters are sick too. It's kind of like an urban, uh, urban feel to them. I almost have all these unlocked too. The tundra, the undergrowth, the frostbite, the icebreaker, the ruins, the arctic sea form, sea foam. Sorry, angles or angels, whatever one you want to say. Um, autumn dazzle, dazzle. Sorry, autumn dazzle, uh, arctic abstract and sharp edges i like the sharp edges a lot um also this one the autumn dazzle is really nice for the fall feel um then we have the topo i don't know if that's how you say it topo we have the off grid the knights night seas the marsh ops uh four station the phosphor the vector trails <coughs> topo trip the baron the baron yeah Vanished and Sandstorm. Okay, those are for the Topo. Uh, there is a hundred different camos for every single gun. Okay, so I mean if you can't pick one between these camos There's something probably wrong with you. Overgrowth, Mudslide, and these are uh, for the Tiger. Okay, I have all these unlocked. The Overgrowth, Mudslide, uh, Dank Forest, which I like that name. Hint, hint. Uh, abominable, 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 whatever. Uh, Faded Veal. Or, oh, that's actually nice. I didn't even see that one. Oh my goodness. I like that camo a lot. Um, the Pharrell Feral Beast. I don't, I'm not too sure. Some of these names, I'm fucking an idiot. So we'll see if I get them right. Tiger Stripes, Desert Cat, um, Red Tiger, and Blue Tiger. Okay, I have all these ones done. Here's are the, here are the stripes, which I was kind of disappointed in. They're, they're all right. Like, this one's one of my favorites. But let's go back to the beginning. Uh, I got Grassland, Tiger Man, Tiger Mane, sorry, Tiger's Mane, the Cayenne, uh, Savannah, Zebra, Bluegrass, Africa, the, whoa, New Wave Zebra, uh, okay, the Green Grass, and the Pink Zebra, okay, so they're mainly zebra colors, here's the Reptiles, which I was also kind of disappointed in, besides the end, because they get bright, but, um, we got... The python, the rattlesnake, the komodo, the blue iguana, the chupacabra, the pink python, the anaconda, the, the blue snake, or the bull snake, sorry, and the gecko, and also the last one is the gardener snake. Okay, that one's nice. And then we have the skulls, which I'm not disappointed in. These are very, very sick. I like this one right here. Towards the end, you can actually see the skulls on the gun. Uh, I do not know how to pronounce that, so... I'm not even going to say the names of these because I have no idea. I'm not going to butcher it. But these are all of them. Haunting, Phantom, Forest, Wraith. Uh, yeah, no. Skullduggery? Skullduggery, in one word. See, like, someone pronounced that for me. C-T-H. Okay. Stahulu? Stahulu. Okay. Hopefully that's right. I don't know. Um, the Lich Yard is, is nice too, but I really like this one. Stahulu. I'm not too sure if that's how you say it. And then we also have the um, Completionist, which is the Gold, Diamond, and Damascus. So these are the camos for the whole weapon. I have actually unlocked all these. You have to get your weapon to level 69 in order to get the skulls. So 69 is not the max rank for the gun, but um, 
it, it it's the max rank for camos so now that you have all the camos unlocked you can start to work on gold and um, I'm, a I'm also going to come out with a video on how to get gold quickly and things like that probably here in the next one, one to two days so y'all be looking out for that video but those are all the guns in modern warfare as of now if you like this video please like it and if you w want to subscribe go ahead and subscribe for more and i'll catch you on the next one peace